So the two primary documents available to support use of the MMPI-3 are the test manuals, the Manual for Administration, Scoring, and Interpretation, and the Technical Manual. Uh, in developing these uh, manuals, we've adhered very closely to the documentation requirements and the standards for educational and psychological testing. The Manual for Administration, Scoring, and Interpretation includes some information about the normative sample, uh, information about uh, uh, recommended uh, practices in maintaining test security uh, and uh, general recommendations for how to administer the instrument and what kind of requirements there are for administering the MMPI-3 uh, to a test taker and obtaining uh, hopefully valid information. Uh, the most detailed chapter in that manual is the interpretation chapter where we offer very detailed guidelines for MMPI-3 interpretation. Everything you need to know in order to interpret the MMPI-3, you'll find in Chapter 5 of the Manual for Administration, Scoring, and Interpretation. The technical manual is the foundational document for the test. Uh, there's a chapter that describes how we went about developing the MMPI-3, and then very detailed uh, information about the reliability, standard errors of measurement, and of course, a lot of validity information for the MMPI-3. Uh, uh, one of the appendixes includes empirical correlates, representing all of the settings where the MMPI-3 is used, mental health settings, medical settings, forensic settings, as well as public safety uh, settings. Uh, and there's a second appendix that actually compares the empirical correlates of the MMPI-3 scales with their MMPI-2RF counterparts. What the goal of, of this appendix was to illustrate that the literature on the MMPI-2RF scales, on the validity and interpretability of the scales, applies to the MMPI-3. We get essentially the same correlates, whether we're scoring the scales based on the MMPI-2RF composition or the composition of the MMPI-3, and that allows us to continue to rely on all of the uh, empirical studies, the peer-reviewed studies that were published on the MMPI-2RF. Those will help support and guide the interpretation of the MMPI-3 as well. We also have a manual supplement for the Spanish language translation of the test that provides information about the Spanish language norms, how these norms were collected and, and compiled, psychometric information about the Spanish version of the MMPI-3 scales, uh, and information about specifically use of the test with Spanish speakers. And we have user's guides for the score and clinical interpretive report, and a second user's guide for the police candidate interpretive report, all intended to help you use the MMPI-3 and get the most information you possibly can when relying on the test.